Hey, we're Roscon 2022 in Kyoto, Japan. I'm here to figure out what the Roscon community is all about. Join me and we'll find out. The part that I like the most about Roscon is to see the industry really shifting the future. In a lot of components, a lot of elements, software, hardware, middleware. We're really going to make it happen that the robots start to change this civilization. What I really like about Roscon is meeting people. In our community, maybe we know virtually through social network, LinkedIn, Twitter, or uh, the forums. And finally, we, you can meet face by uh, to face uh, other people and really shake hands. Uh, and that's so great. My favorite part of Roscon is meeting all the robotics users and developers and the creativity that occurs here. In my opinion, it's all the cool robots that are moving around and that they're using the perception uh, to, to see the world around them. My favorite part of Roscon is to see that there's a lot of uh, companies that have developed hardware that is compatible with Rost and that's uh, industrial grade also. That's really nice to see uh, this because uh, a few years ago it was all about uh, uh, some uh, gaming cameras. We're demonstrating our Husky robot as well as our Dingo robot. We also have the new TurtleBot 4 here. Uh, I love to be part of a community that is open source and that has helped me so much during my PhD and now that I'm in industry I use uh, open source packages a lot so I'm happy to be here, willing to help that everyone has here. Picnic is a company that is a leading software in robotic manipulation. Uh, we've been uh, doing this for 10 years, uh, we do consulting uh, and now we also have uh, our own software product that is called Mood Studio. We are showing research we're doing in Intel Labs about human-robot collaboration. So we are trying to get robots to read a body language so that they become more flexible uh, collaborators and people actually like working alongside them. So Ubuntu is one of the most used Linux OSs out there and people love to develop robotics applications on top of that. <laughs> Therefore, drone developers use tools as PX4 on top of Ubuntu to develop their own drone applications, autonomous drone, different applications. All of these help the field develop new state-of-the-art technology and also, again, go to market with their devices faster. Oh, okay, we are presenting our company. We are a service company that provides resources for uh, robotic companies. We have a team of engineers that can team up with your team and uh, help you develop uh, your solution. We have a human-robot collaboration demo uh, featuring some of the capabilities of our newest processor and cameras from Intel. This work enables human and robots collaborate incrementing the throughput of the task by reducing the time that the human and the robot need to wait for each other. We're also showing high performance computer vision algorithms using our processors and making these components accessible to everyone to see how Intel can help every single of these roboticists to push their limits into their task. This robotics is a passion of mine. I've seen the community really grow over the life of Roscon, so it's it's awesome to see the things that are that people are doing and bringing robots into the real world. So, yeah.